Hey, Chuck here. I wanted to do a video talking about antennas and long range. So yeah, I just put down this whiteboard and some of my equipment because I was going to remanufacture some antennas that I bought from AliExpress. And um, let me just go through some of the parts of what I, what I have on the board here. So on the left here, I, I have my DJI digital video goggles. And uh, on these, I have these video antennas. There are 5.8 uh, gigahertz, five turn helical antenna, and it's directional. You can see this pointed um, in a direction. So anything out in front of this is gonna get 11.8 dB of gain. So that means it amplifies the sing signal a bit. And if you turn your head to the side, um, these goggles have um, omnidirectional antennas as standard on them, but the lower position of them are replaced with uh, directional five-turn helical antennas. You can see the coils. There's five of them there. So what that does is it allows you to, to look or face in the direction of the drone and uh, get a lot better signal, you know, which means more distance and penetration. Right here is a digital video transmitter, and I did not write this down, but it is a 5.8 gigahertz as well. This is happens to be a DJI uh, model, and uh, in the back here, there's like a couple uh, ports for antennas. These are the MMCX antennas, and here's the FPV cam right here. So it's digital video being transmitted back to the goggles. So on a drone, um, you have these antennas on the back. So I used Farview antennas for a long time, and then Farview is now out of business. So what I've been doing is I've been buying these cheapo video antennas from um, AliExpress and remanufacturing them to uh, be a lot higher quality. I can, I'll go into a video about that later, but they're also 5.8 gigahertz, and the design is called Pagoda because of the layers of... Uh, of boards there on the antenna and they are omnidirectional so they put out a pattern that's more of a um, an apple shaped uh, pattern you know sort of a dimple on each on the top and the bottom um, to connect these things you have to use some sort of adapter and they call them a pigtail so on the end of the pigtail there's this uh, connector called an MMCX and uh, I guess I could have written down some of that stuff could have been a little bit more organized on this MMCX. And this is a SMA. I don't know if this is an RP. I have to figure out what is RP or not. But basically, you want to make sure that the end of the antenna either has a male or female on it. And this one, um, there's no pin sticking out, but they call this the SMA male, RPSMA male. And on the other end, where it connects, you have to have the, the pin on the on the um, drone side to connect into the antenna. So you can see that pin sticking it out right there. So anyway, this is a this is a male. Uh, pigtail I talked about. This is a standard antenna right here, but it's just not a very good antenna, so that's why um, I replaced them with these uh, Pagoda antennas. So just part of the setup here, we've got these, this jig that I can put the antennas into just to do a little bit of manufacturing, remanufacturing, and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, realign, if you can see this antenna, just a cheapo antenna, the marks are not lined up, so I'm just going to heat it up and rotate these around so that they're um, aligned and that'll improve it and then uh, make sure that everything is properly spaced out uh, between the boards and it'll be you know just a great great tuned antenna um, probably just as good of quality as, as, as these far view antennas that I used to make and uh, just one thing you don't need a super long antenna to fly long range Look at these antennas on here. This is a very short antenna. I mean, look how short that this antenna is. Um, you know, I can fly miles uh, with this uh, setup, you know, crossfire. I have my crossfire antenna here. But um, yeah, so that's the antenna setup. 
for my long range. Oh, I guess I could have showed you some of these covers, 3D printed covers, sort of clean things up, make it a lot nicer. And that's it.